Hello everyone and welcome back to Moonstone Island. My name is Melanie B. It is now Sunday the 7th day of fall and here we are once again rescued by Waldo. Okay, let's head on outside and we are on a fire island and we got some mail. Have you seen a beardini? They're so cute. Please, 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 can I have a beardini? Rowan said you are helping people get spirit, and I want one so bad. I might die, okay? Oh yeah, it's Farrah, by the way. Okay, bye. Okay, I don't think we've found a beardini so far. Uh, I wonder where we find that. Let's check out our quest. So, for Quill, we still need a cuddly fire spirit. Farrah wants a beardini. Or she might die. And a capacity for Osono. Maybe we should go hunt down a capacity. But for Quill, we need a fire spirit. Um, what kind of fire spirit could he want? Maybe it's, maybe he wants a shimp. A shimp. Because they're kind of cuddly, I guess. And yeah, let's maybe look for a shimp before we leave this island. Any shimps hanging around? I don't want to give away the one that I have. There's a skeleton down there. Don't need that. We want a sheep. Oh, there's some treasure up there. Get these culberries. Sheep, come on out, please. We can't survive here very much longer. But would be nice if we can find one single sheep. Where are all the sheep hiding? There's another skeleton. And there. Why is there so many skeletons? Let's get across this way. We may just have to leave this island because there seems to be only skeletons available. Why are there no shimps? Maybe if we encounter... Oh, there's one! Shimp! Come here! He's level 15. We should be able to take him down, though. Oh, we only have two spirits with us. This is not a good idea. Uh, let's run away. <laughs> we'll have to get Capacity back on our team. Um, we don't have very much energy left, so let's just use our whistle and head home. And there is... Cleo and Zed, but his spirit seems to be stuck behind a tree. Well, that's kind of odd. And we got some mail. Let's see what's in the mail. This time from Mother. Hi, Puppet. Your father's birthday is coming up, and I'd love to give him an abundance potion, but I can't make one myself because it'll ruin the surprise. Can you craft one for me and put it in your cell crate? Osona will make sure it gets to me. I've got something for you in return. It's something your father made, and he'd love for you to have it. Okay. So I have to make this Birdeus Giftarium. <laughs> We'll have to complete that potion, I guess. Let's check out that quest again. Abundance potion on the cauldron. Okay. Let's go check in on our spirits. And we got a few items. Let's get some fiber in. And we'll take capacity with us. I also need to find a capacity, another one. Okay, let's go ahead and move 
capacity to the medallion. And we'll do some more feeding. And you go. And we got some sea glass. We'll definitely take that. But we will make sure everyone is fed. So I think we shall go back out on the hunt again today. We've got two stalls that are open, so we can find two more spirits. Oh, poor Flipox. He wants to come with us, but we don't have space in our medallion. Okay, let's go put some seeds away. And we'll probably put some of our harvest away as well. So I'm going to hang on to the tiny flower. But we can probably put the aplum away and the callberries away. The black flower has a lot of tame power to plus 40. Maybe we'll hang on to that too. Sure, why not? And in here, I guess we can place our fiber away for now. I need to get some more wood because I'm probably going to be needing some more bridges. Got tons of stone. We're good there. Okay, uh, moonstone in. We'll put the sea glass in as well. Some of the spark and the poison too. Got a couple of potions on us. I don't think we need to carry around so many potions. Well, we should probably get a fire potion, a fire resistance potion. Oh, here's one right here. Uh, let's switch this with this one. I'm gonna grab this hook out of there. We can just stick it into this chest instead. Okay. So we got this concoction that gives 40 stamina, 30 HP, 2 power, and 2 speed. That is a nice one. Let's actually put the clay away too. Maybe I should sell some of the clay. Holy cow, we have a lot of that. Yeah, let's sell a bit of this. We'll hang on to about 40. And now for our cauldron. What can we make? So we need abundance potion, speed, light, poison. This will be good to make. Um, poison gain potion. Regain stamina from poison hazard for one day. That'd be nice too. Skill reset. Where is the Abundance Potion? Oh, it's still locked. Trees and rocks drop 30% more resources for one day. How do I get this unlocked? Mom, you were supposed to unlock that potion for me. Oh well, I guess she did not. And... We'll go ahead and sell some of these and i got some talismans here we even got a free talisman from waldo last time for a study so who are we gonna give those to let's see we'll jump into our medallion shemp um let's give shemp a new card whoops I'll do feed. So, 24 fire damage, planned flames, double all enemies burn, or impatience. Put two random attack cards from your drawer or discard pile on top of your draw pile. 
Um, I think I like Torch. We'll get that one. And maybe we should give Shemp some upgrade. So let's meditate. We can do that one. Regroup, tackle, and just a regular torch. We can upgrade to torch plus. Um, I'm gonna go with the torch plus. And capacity, let's give you one, maybe. If there's some good options here. Blind blow, surge, flip switch. Deals 13 electric damage three times. Okay, I don't see the difference here. Other than there's a green arrow going down and a red arrow going across. Now there's a green arrow going down too. No idea what that means. <laughs> Um, we can probably upgrade the tackle card. Let's do that. And for Gimlin, I think we're going to cleanse some of Gimlin's cards out of here. He's got so many. So the consume, choose two cards to discard. Seasons 14. I know I like that. I like that. I love all of Gimlin's cards. <laughs> He's got the best ones. Furry of blows. Deals. No, that's a good one too. Deal seven damage and draw two cards. That's good stuff. Yeah, Gimlin's cards are just good. Um, there's a regular tackle. No, these are also tackle plus uppercut. This is not that great. Um, we can probably get rid of that. It's hard to get. Let's try getting rid of more of the uppercut ones. All the way to the end. We have a bunch of bash cards. We like bash. Um, I don't really care for the rage cards at all. And we could probably get rid of that focus card too. Let's do it. Use up our last cleanse. Okay, goodbye focus card. And we will head out of the pocket. Now, it's already 3 o'clock. And I do want to go visit some other islands, but we won't have the ability to use our whistle back. So we'll have to be using our glider so we can't stay out too late. Okay, let's look on the map here. Well, there is a fire island down here we can get to. It's pretty close, I guess. But I kind of also want a, an electrical island too. Are these ones electrical? Okay, let's try going and find an electrical island. Or maybe we should just go find some more talismans. There's a lot of freebies out there again. Yeah, we are heading up north. We are going on a talisman hunt. And if we happen to land on an electrical island, fantastic if we find a fire island. Just as great. But let's head out. I need to make some more bridges too. I just don't have enough wood right now. But off we go. Yeah, we'll just go to this first island here and grab this talisman first. And this just seems to be an Earth Island. We don't really need any spirits from here. Grab a Meditate. And we'll grab some of these goodies as well. Why not? We can sell them for sure. And this is a fairly easy island. Spirits are not that difficult. But we're not going to be bothering fighting them. Let's head over. 
to another island. Which one is close by? Yeah, let's go. Just keep heading north. And this is a poison island. We actually need to get a couple of things from the poison island for the fall temple. But let's get some of these. And you will find the talisman as well. Okay, and we'll take that. Let's take one more cleanse. We'll just alternate between the cleanse and the meditate. Okay, let's head off of this island. Where are we going to go next? Oh, there's a spirally looking island here. That's definitely a fire island. And there's one undiscovered back here. Let's see if we can get up there. I'm sure we can. Oh, we're running actually low on energy. Um, let's go ahead and eat some of that. Um, what does this do? I just ate one of these and it gives minus 10 stamina. That was a bad idea. Uh, we can eat the flag flower <laughs> instead. Okay, we're good again. And off we go. So we got one more island over here we can take the talisman for. We'll take that, another meditate. Oh, we got a swirling vortex. Oh, there's a moonstone here. How did we miss that? And we got some Will-O-Wisp. Now maybe there is different types of crops later at night. What is this guy? I've never seen him before. He's new. I don't want to fight him though because he's level 21. We will avoid him. Yeah, I don't know if there's different crops available depending on the time of day you visit the island. Okay, it is already 9 o'clock. Maybe we should be heading back, but I want to go check out and see what is this new island over here. And we are out of the eye of the storm. What kind of island is this? The spirits here are very high. This island is... Oh, oh, this must be the dark island because there is one poop that we need to collect that is dark matter. So maybe it is for this island. Oh my goodness. Look at these. Let's get some of these crops. And Waldo is here. He knows. He's like, oh, this is a dangerous island. You shouldn't be here. We need to get an upgraded site to collect these though. That's too bad. Um, I see a moonstone, but I also see a very scary... Oh my goodness! Uh, level 60? Waldo, save us! Let's just get out of here. That was scary. But that is our first encounter with one of those dark islands. So, we're going to have to go back there at some point and take down those spirits. But let's head back. Let's head back home. Do we have enough energy to make it all the way back? Um, I hope so. Okay, are we on the right 
path back home. Um, we actually have quite a ways to go. Come on, glider. We can do it. I should have stopped there and gotten that talisman. Oh well. We didn't do that. We're just gonna head back. Okay, here we are. Back in the nick of time. So we'll need to get our site upgraded. So maybe we'll go see Pear tomorrow and do that. But we don't have anything to sell. We do have a skelly plant that is new. And we also got the specter flower. So yeah, we'll have this guy gives plus 50 team points. That is nice. Yeah, we'll definitely need to get the seeds for these. And this willow wisp 250 experience. Very good. But let's get into bed. And we shall call it a day. Okay, so we didn't get to clear any dungeons or tame any spirits. But for all that clay we sold, we made 1800 coins. Fantastic. And I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.